Hey guys, I'm back. Uh, so, um, pretty interesting one. Um, this video is actually taking place almost directly after uh, my last video. Reason being, um, the last video, go out, watch it, um, was the uh, juice launch I went to and it was actually outside my car, outside my home, we were actually at a vape shop. So go check that out, it's a nice short little video, um, pretty worth it. Now, before I get started on what I have next to me, um, let's go through, which again in my last video, I was vaping on the same stuff, uh, but more in depth. So, Pulse, a mechanical squonker with a Flav 22 on here. So what I've got in there is Buckwild's birthday cake. Love this stuff. I'm never without a bottle. Um, on my RSQ regulated squonker. Nudge 22 on there. Awesome. I've got, um, again, okay, never without a bottle. Red pearl it's bottle seen better days. I keep filling up scrum poles. As you can see, I'm running out, but I'm clever. I bought another bottle the other day, it's sitting in my cupboard, and yeah, that, that stuff I cannot live without. On my Wismic Luxotic, as I keep telling you guys, I am getting myself a second one of these in black because I love the device so much. Dead Rabbit SQ, that's the 22 mil on here. Hits like a bloody beast. Um, I should squonk. But what I've got on there is Pompous Palms, uh, Mrs. Sourberry Sour Jelly Candy. It's the sour worms. And yeah. I'm also running a little on this. I haven't vaped on it in a while, but I do. I love that juice. Now, uh, literally, I haven't really unpacked these things. I've literally taken the covers off. This is what I picked up after yesterday's video. I went down to Gadget Funny. Big, big shout out to them. Prices are amazing. Selection's amazing. Juices, mods, drippers, battery wraps. Uh, one of the very, very... Well, I think they are the only people in KZN that I know of that has uh, 2700 battery wraps situated down here in Durban. Because we are awesome. So, start off with uh, this bad boy. This is the Wismic um, it's Machina. Um, single battery mod. Uh, Relux RX Machina. Um, yeah, so your basic cuck on the back. Sorry, I should have actually gone read all this before. Basic what it comes with and bits and pieces. So it's the first time I'm taking everything out. I should put this battery on charge. It comes with a battery. There's another version that comes with a dripper, but apparently that the dripper isn't very fantastic. So what I'll go through first is this bad boy. Now this is an interchangeable sleeve. Uh, all we have is the spring load is actually on the top, not the bottom. And it is a non harbor it's got a 510 on there, which is awesome for you guys that are worried about safety. This, as it says, a 2700, but it comes with a 18650 sleeve, very nice little sleeve with uh, Wismic punched out on both sides. Now, removable sleeve with a an O-ring and a very weird design, cutout design there. I'm guessing to save weight. Um, fire button, which is not spring loaded, but as I said, the spring is in the top there. Sleeve on. Actually, I think I'm going to go down and get a, I might get a 
leather wrap for this. Pretty little, pretty little thing. Battery, nothing much to speak about there. It's your basic, although apparently pretty good, uh, 2700, but 2700s are pretty much the same. And some spare O-rings. Uh, it's about all you get in this huge box, two spare O-rings. But I'm not complaining. I'm going to get this thing fired up later. So stoked with that. So that's that's that. And we go over to the squeezer. Which I've been looking for another 2700 uh, squonker. Um, because I do have quite a few 2700 batteries for some reason. But that's never a bad thing. Now I have not taken the cover off this box. I've literally taken the plastic off. This is the first time I'm really getting into this. On the back mod which can take 26650 and 2700 um, batteries it's got an 18650 adapter uh, 10 milliliter silicon bottle now if, I don't think that means what the say it means um, in the box you're gonna get your mod and this little user manual very 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 basic user manual very basic I mean pretty self-explanatory these things uh, before we get onto the mod let's go what uh, we have under all of this gunk so we have a spare super 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 squishy um, and it does look pretty big so I'm guessing this is this is the spare Temo bottle there is a bottle in the mod a black one and it comes with a it's supposed to be clear but it's like white bottle just saw this a warranty card don't worry about that and then this bad boy which is in and itself is uh, pretty pretty good now this is a refill bottle you can hear that so what actually happens is you screw it onto your 510 there okay squeeze it turn around so all the air comes back out your bottle on the inside all the air goes in there if you need to do it again and you can actually carry this around with you personally i think these things are pretty silly nice threads super super big easy easy to take apart which a lot of squonk bottles are are kind of difficult to get this ring off to, to wash them can't complain too much with the threads for the price I mean that didn't bind up on me so no complaints there I doubt I'll use it purely for the fact of when I go through a bottle by the time I'm finished with the bottle it's time to re -wick anyway come to the mod so this is 3d printed as far as I know door comes off no magnets that I am aware of. It's simply a pressure fit. But these things, these mods are fairly cheap. So I'm not complaining. It looks like there was supposed to be, there's supposed to be magnets in there. And they didn't do it, I suppose. Well, I'm not complaining. I mean, unless you drop it, I don't think that's going to come off in a hurry. Um, so I'm not going to worry about if there were magnets or weren't magnets 18650 adapter very nice looking one with plus and minus on it very very nice i like that um i like that it does have your plus and minus on there and if you look in here as well you also have nice and big nice and easy to spot plus and minus symbols with your black squonk, uh, squonk bottle in there Contacts look good. Fire button in the lock in the lock position is up and it doesn't move. Now this is nice because the, the Athena if you really pushed on it would uh, would fire, but this is just solid. There's no movement in the lock position. Bottom nice action, decent looking contacts, spring loaded 510 no complaints there so again big shout out to gadget fundi for cooking me up um 
I did I did pay for this stuff, but with these specials, you can't complain. So this was bought and gone over purely because I did purchase this. So I think we'll leave it there. Um, obviously, when I do vape on them, I'll probably do a video and go through bits and pieces. Not too in-depth, but I mean, judging by the mods, I don't see, and judging by other reviews and stuff, I can't, I can't see any issues with, uh, with uh, being with any of them. So uh, I'm gonna leave it there. Um, so until next time, keep it cloudy.